Welcome back to Remember Me. It's time to return to the leaking brain. What the hell's going on back there? Somewhere. Uh, oh right, this we have the spammer. LB and RB. Okay. This thing is, it looks like inside, next to some creepy lights and red chairs. Obviously this is the main way, so let's look for extras. Extras like that big casserole on the ground. Yummy. The object's somewhere here. I also haven't checked over here yet. No squatting. Yes, Bob, I mean you. Scaramex are parasites that feed on ambient memory transfers. Listen carefully for their distinctive sound to locate them and shoot them with a spammer to gain a PMP bonus. Oh, am I not close enough? Oh, just takes more than one hit. Oh, so they're like bonuses. Found one out of 55. Okay. Things took a bad turn around here. Yeah, that's a lot of bodies, and they didn't die from the rushing water that came in here. The enigmatic errorist leader, known simply as Edge, has taken credit for this outrageously cool act of sabotage. The botched arrest of TG memory burglar Dylan, errorist and Edge's current fun buddy, seemed to confirm the errorist leader's claim. Chief of State Report, Captain... New Paris history. The Leapers appear. <clears throat> this contribution was considered biased by the majority of viewers. The first documented sightings of Leapers dated from 2073. Several theories emerged down the years to explain the origin of their mutation. Pollution, biological warfare, genetic accident, radiation, etc. But none of these were officially accepted to explain their existence. What a load of crap. The authorities insisted they were hiding in the darkest and most dangerous areas of cities and used this argument to justify their policy of repression, but they were looking at the problem from the wrong angle. Leapers didn't appear in the poorer districts, nor were they the result of appalling sanitary conditions. Leapers went to those dangerous areas because they had nowhere else to go. Every inhabitant of Neo-Paris had heard of a neighbor, friend, or colleague who had started showing signs of leaperization before disappearing altogether. This illness clearly spread in a way that was still not understood, and the filth was moving everywhere, even to the wealthy districts. The epidemic was raging. Wake up, Neo-Paris. has promised a take-no-prisoners approach to counter this threat to neo -Paris. I know stuff is going on over there, but like, check out this lasagna. Doesn't look too bad. I'd eat it. No, I wouldn't. In a place where the lighting's all red, it's in a corner. There's another lasagna. Oh man, there's so many lasagnas. A new combo is available in the combo lab. Ah, oh, finally! We have a third one. Oops. Oh 
Oh my god, that's a long one. Six instead of five. Okay, uh, I don't actually have nearly enough presents to fill this thing out is kind of the problem. This one's X, Y, Y, X, Y, Y. It's not the usual alternating. Yeah, do I want to do anything with this in particular? I mean, I guess I might as well put this one in this one to make that my super big one. Because again, I don't need to actually finish the combo for it to be effective. Yeah. Where's this one going to be taken from? Oh no, I don't have that one yet. Well, I'm not going to take it from myself, so it's going to be that one. We have a free one here. Let's see if I even can fill this out. I don't think I have enough Ys, do I? No, I, I can't fill it out. Okay. Uh, well, I guess I should remove this one. Let's just remove all of these. So this one's still my S present cooldown building thing and also healing, which is nice. Although this one does it too. Hmm. I think I'm just going to stick with this, I guess. Although since this one does healing and S present cooldown, maybe this one should be my pure damage. I just make this all damage. How much how much damage will that do? 125, 175. So this one still does more damage just because these two uh damage presents, power presents appear later in the chain. So then I don't really have any reason to use this one, do I? Huh, whatever. X, Y, Y, X, Y. It's something like if you hit a six combo, it'll give you extra something. So it would be nice to hit a six combo. It's going to be a little bit more difficult for me to remember X, Y, Y, X, Y, because it's not as simple as just alternating between X and Y. It's not that complicated, though. I'm sure I'll be fine. 966 degrees Celsius. Looked like they were motioning me on, like, come on, come on, walk into it. Something I can jump up onto? Oh, wait. Welcome to Magnus, a daily politically incorrect news source and general blabathon. My casual Captain Gabriel Trace, the also serious chief of Saber Force. Howdy, Captain. Wait, what does that say? Bits. B oh. Really? <laughs> oh, babes, babes in the shell. More than valets. They're valets.
Well, this is a fighting arena. Let's go. Ooh, we got a big one. I gotta take out the smaller ones first, because they'll power up the big one. Shoot at prowlers who are hanging on walls with a spammer. Ah! thing. It took a lot of damage in that fight. Drop down or go up. Not sure which is the extra way. Is this where I'm supposed to go? I'm just gonna drop. Oh, this is just where I just was. <laughs> Oops. Oh, that's cool. They thought of the fact that you might go there, so they made it so you can unlock the door that blocks you from leaving the fight arena. That's a good sign, sister. It means your core memory resisted the treatment. Jax knows everything. Jax does everything. Jax looks out for your children, and your children love him. I wonder if I want more healing. Uh, I guess I can't really get more healing because it's already at the end, so that's the most powerful the regeneration can be unless I had another Y to put in the slot. Which I don't. 
To celebrate his 25th anniversary, Classic Jax is back, but with all the latest innovations, <gasps> making him toy number one this season. Jax the Panda, a Happy Place product. Happy Place, the place for fun. Jax knows everything. Jax does everything. Landmarks. Slum 404? Yeah, we already read about the ship. Slum 404. Born out of the ruins of the Civil War, Slum 404 is a vast, partially flooded shanty town that has emerged from the rubble of a Paris devastated by Tremora bombs. Slum 404 is one of the ravaged districts still to be renovated, sometimes known as Deep Paris. The inhabitants of Slum 404 endure harsh living conditions in this chaotic urban environment, with filthy unsafe buildings and a deprived population often in a state of extreme psychological and social distress. Geographically, Slum 404 is a maze of islands and terraces separated by chasms formed by landslides and linked by a network of walkways. Transport in the slum is mainly by boat along the canals formed by the various locks that separate the area. The water is rarely treated and contains a host of pathogens and toxic substances. The appalling sanitary conditions in the depths of the slum dramatically reduce the life expectancy of its residents. Some neighborhoods high above the rubble and detritus are better organized and are now flourishing living spaces. The most striking of these must be the Plateau, home of the Leaking Brain Bar, an establishment famous way beyond the boundaries of Slum 404, and where it's not unusual to meet more affluent citizens out for some dangerous thrills. The disturbing leapers lurk deep in the abandoned tunnels and flooded passageways left over from the pre-war era. No one dares to venture down here except those who have lost their minds or memory junkies who are near death. According to neighborhood legend, this is where the old hermit from Slum 404, Johnny Greenteeth, is holed up. Some have said that on nights when the toxic fumes rise up from the pits, they carry the hermit's moans and cries to the slum above. A hell of a jump. So many of them, it's hard to get a full combo off. To the sense and menu. Uh, okay, why? <laughs> yes? A new class of presents is available. Oh! Chain present inherits and multiplies the effects of the previous presence in the combo. Okay. The previous one. So not all the previous ones, but just the previous one. Okay. Chain presence is rare and very powerful. Choose where you place it wisely. Also remember that the further a present is placed in the combo, the bigger its effect will be. This also applies to chain presents. Ah, and that's what I needed to finally finish out this six combo. 
So right now it's going to multiply regeneration. Let's see how much it does. Oh, Jesus, this is going to make regeneration go from 14 to 44. As well as also just giving me more damage. Do even the regeneration ones give you some damage? And you'll get 20 PMP if you get that off. Um, yeah, if I replaced this with damage... God, total damage will go up so much because of the multiplier. But that doesn't answer my question, however. Question, okay, yeah, so even the healing ones do give you some damage. So even if it's not their specialty, everything gives you damage. Although I don't know, but the S present cooldown, but probably. So yeah, do I want to be healing? Uh, do I want to be multiplying the heal? Like, I don't think I need to heal that much, do I? I don't think so. So I think I want to multiply damage. And this, this has to be healing. Interesting. I wonder how this is going to go, because the early attacks are all... Uh, they all do a little bit of damage, of course, but they're all kind of support stuff. Regeneration, S present cooldown, and it's only the last three that are going to do a lot of damage. And boy, will they do a lot of damage. Especially the last one. Eh, it should be alright. XYY XYY. There it is, boom! We got another key. So it can either be an S cooldown or healing. Hmm. And it's an X healing. I don't really know which one I want. An X healing or an X cooldown. Yeah, I don't really know. I'm just not going to spend it then. Brain pain. I know that feeling. You know, I think there's a slight speed bonus or something like that to, um, this might be hard to explain. When you're doing the Fury Sense in, Remember how the tutorial thing said it doesn't matter like which one you use, you can't do combos, just kind of mash X and Y and hit them as much as you can? It does seem to actually matter a little bit whether you hit X or Y. Because normally in the past I've just been hitting X and the biggest combo I've been able to get is 9 hits before it runs out. But this time I was alternating X and Y and X and Y and I managed to get 10 hits in. That's the first time that's ever happened. So, I don't know, I'll keep trying it, but I think there might be a slight speed bonus to alternating between X and Y rather than just doing one. Okay, the thing is out of place. Cool. Okay, now... 
a little bit more seriously, I see a red line in the background going over like a blue poster thing. That's blue and red, kind of. I don't know. I'm just going to explore thoroughly. I'm not going to try to match the picture. Is it down there? It might just be down here. Yeah, it's just right down here. They're never far away, are they? Is that a fish? I'm trying to figure out what the thing is on the left. Are they drying their clothes next to fish? That's probably not a fish. I'll be damned if I know what it is, though. Neelan, I'm waiting for you at the Leaking Brain. I'm looking forward to helping you find Johnny. Johnny? Johnny Greenteeth. The bogeyman of Slum 404. He still remembers all the old passageways beneath La Bastille. Yeah, at least that's what Edge says. Okay, I'm inbound. Did they just call us Neelan? It's Neelan like Vanillan. No secrets. Oh, <laughs> God, I didn't even look where I was going. It's so dark. Wait, where am I going? Ah. Invisible one? What was that? Not happy. Even the fan spin. I love it when fans spin in games. And look, this one must be broken. Hmm, food.
Tommy. I just had a run-in with some leapers. Scary. They vanish at will. I stopped being surprised by any of the evil shit that comes out of those tunnels a long time ago. I'll be there soon. Until I get there, keep your eyes peeled. Oh, damn. I was almost dead. Do I need to work more healing in here? This is as far ahead healing can be. Wait. Wait, no, that's not true, is it? We have an X healing that I haven't used. So I could replace this one with it. It would do a bit less damage, but not a huge amount less, because we still have that damage all the way at the end, and then the multiplication. I think it's worth it. It does, however, mean if I don't get off the full combo, I'm going to do very little damage. The first four hits are not going to do much. But that's probably fine. Shiny the ground is... and DOS shuts down all sense and stuns all enemies, reveals invisible ones. Nice. Open the S present wheel, highlight the double question mark sense and DOS. So it's got a pretty long cooldown. It was like a hundred seconds till it'd be usable again. Much more than the Fury.
Okay, up it is. Oh. This is a puzzle, isn't it? Yes. So I need a I need to be able to get over to my destination. That should do. Get over there. Well, we can fix that from here. Would I be able to jump up to the next level? It's yellow. That tells me probably not, but let's try it. Not what it was before. Oh, no, we're good. on a timer. brain poster it's not a poster billboard Jason! 